Good morning, guys, and welcome to another episode of Australian Rural Adventures. You know me, my name's Dougie, and of course, I'm very excited to bring this content to you. Got a bit of a treat for you today. I've got the OG, the original gangster, the $2,000 Tourer, and their new owner meeting up with me. And we've also got Troy coming along in his Subaru Outback as well. Of course, I'm here in the $10,000 Tourer, uh, my Land Rover Discovery 3, and we're going to go find some tracks. Tracks that you could do. Here comes trouble. Hello, beautiful. Hey, gorgeous. How are you? <laughs> I'm good, mate. Better for seeing you. Oh, mate. Makes me blush this early in the morning. <laughs> you brought a friend? <laughs> oh, yeah, I suppose. <laughs> call him that. The friend's a strong word. Yeah. The, the word friend gets thrown around a lot these no, days. Too often. <laughs> nice to see you, mate. Hello, big boy. How you going? Nice to see you, mate. You too. <laughs> So everyone, this is Bailey. There you go. <laughs> and the two thousand dollar Tourer. How are you enjoying it? Oh, I love it. Yeah. Probably the best car I've ever. You're not just saying that, are you? Nah, seriously. <laughs> seriously. So much fun. It's kind of weird seeing the two thousand dollar Tourer. It's like um, seeing my ex girlfriend with a new guy. All right, everyone. For your reference, uh, we are leaving a place called Pinjarra. Beautiful little country town. Yeah, we're heading east up Pinjarra Williams Road towards Dwelling Up. I'll see you there. Just continue straight through dwelling up guys. It's going to be wet out there ladies and gentlemen. 26.3 kilometres and we've turned into here, left into here. Have you got phone reception? Yeah. <laughs> yeah I got one bar actually. Do we dare to air down? Yeah. Maybe a little bit. Yeah. A little bit? Get a bit wet. We're gonna air down in the rain. Fun. <laughs> it's just supposed to be fun. I like what you've done here. Obviously, we we're talking about it earlier. Yeah. But you've made it safe now. He's put some. What's that called? Pinch weld. Yeah, I think that's what they call it. Yeah, pinch weld. So instead of being a razor sharp edge there now, um, young Bailey has been clever enough to cover that up, not make it a huge hazard. It's also obviously chucked the roof rack on, which is great. I never utilised the roof bars, and I should have. Another thing he's done. He's chucked a, um... <laughs> well, there's a lot of clay in here, mate. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, he's chucked a seat cover on there now. Because the last seat cover obviously got donated to the Holland Track. Centerline car. Troy's lovely cock. <laughs> I reckon that's... <laughs> you would know. Yeah. <laughs> now, Troy, another thing I should say, has been nice enough to donate a quick deflator to me, which is fantastic. Not plugging the product or anything like that. It's a quickie uh, tire deflator. So thank you very much. Troy, you're a sweetheart. Um, so, yeah, I've never used a proper tire deflator before. before. <laughs> I just always use my key. So it's nice to have a bit of, um, a bit of luxury. No idea how to use it. No idea. Troy, how do I use this? I need that ult. How, how do you use it? <laughs> oh, it's that bit. I'm literally just showing him how to use this too. Oh. <laughs> oh mine's broken. Yeah, I was like, I need an adult. Yeah. <laughs> so this bit. Oh, okay. Fair enough. You can, uh, yeah, see how inept I am as a full driver. No, it's still not doing it. So, so, but then this this holds the valve core. Yes. Correct. Okay. Right. So the valve core, I understand. So that holds the valve core out, and then that. Good champ. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, boys. So we're all air down. Twenty-ish. Ish. Twenty. I'm on twenty. You're on twenty. Twenty. 20. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Then we're going to go up this power line track here, which looks suspiciously easy. Yeah, it looks convenient to see me. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> we're going to get ourselves in trouble. <laughs> That's it. Let's do it. Absolutely chuffed to be out with the boys. Uh, Troy, I'm getting to know quite well. Bailey, obviously, um, the first time hanging out with him, other, other than when he came and bought the car. So, get really looking forward to getting to know him um, and doing some good wheeling. Uh, this track looks pretty cool. 
very easy so far. Uh, it's just a road, looks like it's just a service road for the power line itself, but you know, it looks can be deceiving and hopefully we can find maybe some offshoots to this track. Bit of wheel lift. It feels uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> I'm standing in the foot world, you know what I mean? Well, you, you still look beautiful. <laughs> now, do you reckon you could reverse up that one? Oh. <laughs> Why do you say this? Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> Point is flat to the floor. Doesn't want to go, mate. Bit of bunty? Bit of bunty, I reckon. Bunty? Yeah. Just to get over Bit of right foot. Bit more bunty. <laughs> <laughs> I've stolen. <laughs> My oil light came on. The pickup must, you must have been there. Yeah. yeah. Must have been quite, a, quite an angle there. You know what? I might let the. No, I can't. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. There is quite a hole at the top there. Yeah. You did our wheel lift on the way down. Oh, awesome. Yeah, how do you feel about that? I, I feel a bit, a bit nervous because when you're on the top, I know it looks like fuck all on the camera, but you just can't see any, any ground beneath there. Yeah. So you've got to just trust that the ground that you saw 10 seconds earlier is still there. <laughs> Alright, guys, after that um, uh, bit of decent downhill there tuck a right into this section here oh, big playground <laughs> there's a dam over there probably something to do with the mine um, but it's totally open and there's no signage to say don't come in here uh, it's all to it's like all free open space so yeah uh, I think we'll have a look around I didn't see any signs on the way in, did you boys? Yeah. Saying private property or something like that? Wait! Whoa! <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like you didn't drive through that. Fucking hell. That's like quicksand, mate. Well, I suppose lucky you got the winch on the yeah. <laughs> The thing is though, if you get the other side, yeah. Of the quicksand. I mean, it's even softer up here, you know. <laughs> this is so slippery, hey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what about there? That looks even easier. Oh, but it's got the sand though, eh? You want to give it a go? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, fuck. Um, I'll move the disco behind you. I'll make sure the winch works. <gasps> wait, wait. <laughs> it is yeah, pretty soft. It's so soft there, mate. Yeah. I think we've got a contender here. <laughs> What's wrong with us? Yeah. I've broken a uh, snatch trap, mate, so it's not very, um, not really filling me with confidence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, what does that tell you? Someone's been stuck here Someone's before. Proper stuck. And, yeah, and they've broken the strap. <laughs> well, but what they is. obviously didn't have was a winch. Yeah. <laughs> There's tracks on the other side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But are they from like summer? <laughs> I'll even put this on in preparation. You know, I'll ever be. <laughs> he's got his recovery point ready. I got the winch rope out between you and me, guys. I think he's going to get stuck. Um, it's just so soft. I know it doesn't look like a lot on camera, but it be interesting to see which line he picks as well. Where are you going to go? Straight up the guts? I'm going to go wherever it lets me go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so soft already. I think 
think we might need a wind. <laughs> oh, that sounds really bad. <laughs> Done yourself a mischief, mate. Oh, that's a good one, mate. That's a really good one. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're not going anywhere. No. <laughs> All right. Oh no. Damn the No, it's hold on, thanks to the, uh, oh, geez, the strap. The yeah. <laughs> the strap's holding it. Oh, I'm going to get out of here somewhere. <laughs> what do you reckon? Alright, pull it again. Just the throttle. Sad. Get on the big jobs. Yeah. How do you look? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thanks, mate. No worries, mate. Jeez. <laughs> Let's have a look at this front bumper, eh? <laughs> Thanks for filming, big boy. <laughs> oh. oh dear. Ooh, Looks like a bit of diarrhea, mate. <laughs> you were damming the river as well. I was worried because I, I think it's going to like build up against oh, you. And like, <laughs> yeah, wow. Well, well I'm, I think we know now that that's probably impossible with uh, the current setups. What? <laughs> Can we go through that? Well, let the witch cool down first. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Your engine light came on. I'm just going to share something really funny with you. Um, you know, Troy just said his engine light came on. He's got a bloody... He's a, he's a mechanic at Subaru. Uh, Bailey is too. And he's got, a, he's got an engine diagnostic tool with him. <laughs> Vehicle speed sensor. Well, maybe because the wheel's just gone... Yeah, just for the ABS. So. Durka, 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 around and around. So it should be right. Nothing to worry about. I'll just clear it off. Oh, I drive my missus car around with a net check engine light since I bought it. I've owned it like two years and it's alright. It doesn't <laughs> stop, then don't worry about it. That's it. <laughs> Top mechanic tip. <laughs> How many uh, times over did your penis uh, increase in size? <laughs> oh, mate. <laughs> <laughs> you reckon? We've got an audience now here. Those lovely people picked up my um, the base of my tripod. Personally, don't have high hopes, but don't tell Bailey that. Go, 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 go! No.
I think it's the nose, mate. Is the nose got you? <laughs> Oh, celebration donuts. Because <laughs> we're stuck in there, mate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, go for it, mate. <laughs> do you mind being on camera or do you want to turn it off? Yeah, sorry. Oh, oh, fun, isn't it? Yeah, that's it, mate. <laughs> yeah, Roggy. <laughs> we tried it earlier in the day with um, Troy's there. Same situation, but Bailey had to come and prove himself, mate, and uh, as it is. Boys will be boys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it, mate? Isn't it? Oh, it's up, up top here. Shows how strong those um, ropes are, hey? So we've um. <laughs> so we've dug out the tyres from the back of the the Ranger there, and we've stuffed some max max tracks under them just to give it a bit more, a bit less, a bit less friction on the mud. So hopefully it pops up and out. Um, well, so we've got the Subi there as an anchor on the, uh, on the other Ranger. Better, better, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> it is working. You've, you've popped out of it a bit. Oh, your front wheels are straight, yes. That winch is working hard. <laughs> His mate has got some very stuck recovery tracks by the looks of it. All right, guys, we're going to continue along the um, the power line track. I think we've had enough of that. Well, I've had enough of that that dam there for a bit. So we're going to head up the power line track uh, and to see where it takes us. Already, some good good bits of ruts here. I think we might have another obstacle, guys. Easy. Easy, Easy. as. <laughs> it's a piece of piss tree. <laughs> Just a bit of bunty, mate. Yeah. Uh, away you go. Easy, mate. Looked worse than it was, that one. <laughs> oh, mate, we just made it look easy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I'm a glass half empty kind of guy. <laughs> Cheeky little uh, hill climb there. Step, uh, rock step? No, oh, not even a rock step. Just a, just a bit of a climb. Uh, now we're continuing on the power line track. We'll come about K and a half, two Ks. Loving it. It's a bit wet, but skin's waterproof. I know it's only a power line track, Whee! but there's a great bit of bush either side. It's, it's really nice through here. Now the sun's come out for us. You know, sun's come out, beautiful day, out in the great Australian bush, uh, exploring some tracks. Nothing too crazy, but still enjoyable tracks. With your mates, where would you rather be, eh?
Mate, Subaru's, mate, Subaru! Yeah. Flew from under my tire. Center of the windscreen. Oh no! Oh dear. Oh. It's a cool pattern, though. That is a really cool pattern. Like if you want your windscreen to break, that's the way you It'll want it. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. I saw it flying. I was like, uh, I can't really go anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. What are you going to do? Get out and catch it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, you trust me? <laughs> There she is. <laughs> Looks like Mr. Subaru there is having a bit of fun. A bit of wheel lift in a Subi. <laughs> it's flexing like a, a brick. <laughs> flexing like a brick, mate. <laughs> <laughs> now this way a little bit. All right, guys. Uh, after about 14 k's, uh, we we've turned around. The track, although really nice looking, uh, beautiful, beautiful greenery and that out here. Uh, I was getting a bit tame. Just becoming a dirt road. I uh, wasn't really washed away, no real obstacles. All right, viewers, time for the outro. Had a good day, mate? Awesome day, mate. Yeah, awesome. good enough? Yeah. How about you, Val? Bloody awesome. Yeah, sick. Join us next time, I guess, yeah. on another episode of Australian Rural Adventures. Yeah. Dougie out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Bailey out. There we go.